Good morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are. Welcome back to Animal Crossing and Chillin' with your host, Kay Daisy. Today, in real life, it is Sunday, and I have to tell you that I'm exhausted. <laughs> uh, weekends for me are not like a fun break time. Uh, they are a fun time because I do have a uh, church job because I'm a singer. So if you're a singer, if you're a classical singer, sometimes you have church jobs where you sing at church on the weekends and they pay you. And this weekend, we were working on a beautiful cantata by Jan Sebastian Bach, number 64. And all I can think of, again, is Nintendo 64 <laughs> while, while saying the name of it. And then we had a very beautiful pooling motet uh, and another little motet and it was just a lot of singing. And also this evening, I have to sing some more. <laughs> there, where I, have a, I have another rehearsal with a different group. And I have to sing some more and I'm tired. But in between this morning's crazy church and this afternoon or this evening's rehearsal, we're going to chill. We're going to relax. We're going to see what's happening on St. Rosie. I also realized I did forget to check the turnip prices in the afternoon, say, yesterday, because we were so busy getting the St. Rosie tea. So maybe we'll check this morning and maybe we'll just sell, you know? We'll just take a loss, probably. Isabel, guten Morgen. 7.44 on Friday, March 29th. March 29th. Mm, that was a good day. Flick is here. He loves the bugs. I also love the bugs. By the way, word on the street is that this year is the year of the cicada double brood, which means the cicada, like the cicadas that come out every, what, 17 or 10 years, something like that. There's two species coming out. And y'all are gonna be covered in cicadas. Get ready. Now, I, listen, I like a bug. I'm all about a bug. And the last time there was kind of a big cicada, uh, I guess, awakening, <laughs> was for me, I remember it was 2004 or 2005. Might have been 2004, because I remember distinctly traveling for work. I was going to a conference, and I went down to Baltimore to go to a conference, because at the time, I was working in international student services, and so I just, I went to like one of those international student services administrative, I don't know. Anyway, I went to a conference, and the cicadas that were in Boston, like not Boston, sorry, Baltimore, there were a lot, but I kept seeing on the news that they were saying you should wear ear protection when you're outside with cicadas. And I'm like, well, it's not that bad. And so for a week, what should I wear this? I don't know. For a week, I, my, my mother was, well, my mother was going to come pick me up from Baltimore and take me to their home in suburban Maryland for a week. I was going to stay with them for a week because I was down for a conference anyway. Might as well stay with them for a few more days. And I saw more cicadas when I was outside the city, okay? And she told me to roll down the window next to the highway because there was a forest with trees there. And the sound from the cicadas, oh my goodness, rock concert type decibels couldn't believe it then I other I understood the ear protection thing I was like oh okay I get it now I get it now and there were so many of them so many look at this does this look like something <laughs> I would wear should I make this work I don't know I'm kind of into the sailor sh sailor shirt but I don't have the skirt that goes with hmm do you think they still have it at uh at Mabel and Sables hmm if they do we should go pick it up I could, oh, that's cute. Wait, this isn't bad. Or should we just, let's see, is there another skirt? 
Anyway, all I'm saying is that the cicadas and and when I saw the cicadas flying about around, uh, no exaggeration, it was a biblical experience. It was like nothing I've ever seen before. I was in awe. And if you can be out with cicadas, I would say just for the experience, experience the cicadas. It's intense. But in a wonderful way, you know? They're not going to hurt you. They're just out, you know, they're just out to me. They're just doing their thing. Aren't some people eating them? <laughs> That's just a question I have. Should I wear this? Clover dress, classic? Or clover dress, like this, this variation? Uh, I don't know what to wear today, gangling. Mm, should, should we like dress up today? Maybe a flight crew uniform. <laughs> no. Uh, I don't know what to wear. I feel like, am I feeling? Wait, do I have like, are we magical girl energy today? Magical girl energy. Wait a minute, hold on. Hold on, I think I'm onto something. Are we a magical girl today? Cause I, I feel like we might be. What do we wear with a, Oh my gosh, so cute. Stop. Actually, I mean, should we listen, I need that black bow back. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need to order it. Don't let me forget. Because that would have been perfect with this outfit. But I'm I'm feeling magical girl today. Should I wear a crown instead? <gasps> Wait, what about the it's not giving the same energy. I mean, that's very cute. But it doesn't have the same, wait a minute, what about, what about the tiara? <laughs> it doesn't have the same energy. I'm, listen, I need card capture Sakura, pretty cure energy. This just isn't doing it for me either. This is more like, um, you know, gothic, uh, cute, gothic Lolita kind of vibes. And I'm not, I'm not feeling that. We might just have to, wait a minute, what about? Wait a minute. Okay. All right. Should we wear glasses or are we? <laughs> Listen, magical girl energy is a thing. And I think, or are we like, are we like rice girl? Tuxedo Mac, uh, <laughs> Tuxedo Max. <laughs> no, listen. Cat girl, cat magical girl, or like that beak? The beak is kind of weird. Bunny? No, we did that. We did that. This is a, wait, is that a cat nose? That's a cat nose. This is the bunny nose. Hate that. Okay, let's do the, it's so cute. Stop it. All right. Four, do we wear, mm. stocking? Mm. <laughs> mm. Maybe? Yes? And then are we boots or are we shoes? If we're magical girl, are we boots or shoes? Boots? Mm. Are we shoes? We're probably shoes, right? These are cute, but they're not the right color. Do they have these in black? I need more shoe choices. Can't have sandals and, and, and tights on, it's against the rules. What about that? No, I mean, ugh, this is classic, right? Magical girl energy. What about the bag? Bag? Um, teddy bear bag? Just the, the blue? What do we do? Who am I anyway? What do I have in my, in my like magical girl bag? Am I? Do I have like magical cards? Should I just go with the star? Or is there a heart bag? Because I have heart things on. No, there's no heart bag. Seems like a missed opportunity, Animal Crossing. Okay, actually, why do I not have a sword? That, <laughs> that just makes sense. It just makes sense. And listen, we, we need a, oh, we got some points. Points, Nook, Miles, Nook, Miles, oh, whoops, Nook, Miles, <laughs> we got Nook, Miles, friends, we're, we're still collecting, we're still collecting, okay, I obviously need a wand, 
I never use a wand. Never, because I think it's kind of, eh, you know. Which one do we do? Cherry blossom wand? Which one has magical girl energy? Do we need a wand? We need something. <laughs> we can't just go around like empty handed. What do, what do we do? Can we, is there a, we don't have a star. Do we not have a star wand? Bueller, hello? I mean, we could do this. Mm. All right, let's look at DIYs. <laughs> I never make wands because I don't use them. So are they under like miscellaneous? Is that what, they wait, are they tools, equipment? Is it equipment? Where the wand? <gasps> look at all these bags. Wait, look, wait. I've never made that. That is so cute. Doesn't it kind of look like you could eat it? Doesn't look like a gummy or something. It looks so delicious. The maple leaf pochette. I never made this. <laughs> Where are the wands at? They're not here in this category. Look at the apple outfit. We've never made that. That's a shame. We gotta, we gotta do that. Or the peach outfit. We've made the pear outfit for some reason because probably because no, there's no reason. Why would we have made this? Because St. Rosie is an orange island. What is happening? Never made the cherry things, although I think this looks like a butt. Don't you think it looks like a butt? That's all I'm saying. Um, the orange one we've never made. You know, that's a shame because that dress is pretty cute. This we've made, oddly enough. Wait, that's also cute. Hold on. Look, RIP to all these DIYs we've never made. All right, where are the wands? Other? Is it other? Someone help. No? No. Uh, not the food. We have eggs in our pocket, uh, evidently. How, where are the wands? <laughs> where are the wands? Wallpapers, floors, ceiling decor, wall mounted, miscellane, is it miscellaneous? I don't see nary a wand here. Housewares, tools, gotta be, right? Okay. Oh my goodness. I've never made any of these. Well, that's not true. I've made this one and this one and this one and this one. Wow. Have it, oh, I made that one, okay. Well, which one do we do? The golden wand? Or, you know what? Why would we not make the star wand? It's also super easy to make. Are there, how many, how many eggs are there? Also, what is this? <laughs> it's kind of cute, I guess. All right, so large star fragment and, oh, we need three of the regulars. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it, gangling. Okay. Three of the littles and one of the bigs. One of the bigs. Okay, down, down, down. Down, down, down. Also, should we make the um the maple pochette? I I really I I think that might be a thing. What do I need? I'm guessing I need maple leaves. Do you think that's it? We'll see. Uh you know. The other question is, do I have a DIY table? Do I? Is that something I own in my house? I don't know. Because there wasn't one upstairs. Is there one down here? I have no DIY table in my house. Really? This room still vibes me out. I love this room. It's still, it's still, it's a whole vibe. I love it. It's all plant, all plants, all time. <laughs> it's good. You're telling me that I don't have a DIY table? Am I just not seeing it? Or I just didn't place one down in my house? What? What is wrong with me? Well, I guess we're gonna have to go outside then. Guess we're gonna have to go outside. All right, I, I need is it, do I need star wand? 
I don't know. I need some kind of... I need something. I need something. I also feel like... Should I change my hair color? Is that a thing that we should do now, too? If I'm gonna give, like, super magical girl energy? I'm, I'm going all out. Okay, star wand. Let's go. It... Does it... Is it not... Does it not coordinate well with what I'm doing? Hold. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Okay. In the comments, if you are an anime fan, do you like Magical Girl anime? And what your fa what's your favorite one? <gasps> we can. Oh, we can make what? What is, what is this? Maple leaf rug? A hello? I don't think I've ever seen that before. <laughs> if you like magical girl anime what's your favorite i mean card capture sakura it's hard for me to pass up but i also love you know what was good pre-tier pre-tier was good too what was the is what was the little theme song it did it go i think it went like that all right let's see what outfits i have Oh. Huh. Oh, deal. Ah, oh, black swan. Love to see it. Feel underdressed, though. So let's look at the other ones. Clog. I haven't changed the. Oh, oh my god! I am adorable. Hello. Please. And can we just take? Wait. That's no, that's what my bangs look like. But the side swept bangs are perfect. Oh my god. Do I need to be dressed like this today? Okay, let's look at the rest of the outfits. Odette? <laughs> okay, white swan. If you are unfamiliar uh, with Swan Lake, which is the best ballet, Odette is the white swan, the main character energy princess. And Odile is the black swan, her, like, imposter. She's not really... She's not... She doesn't pretend to be Odette for a long time. Uh, okay. Uh, let's... Let's... Let's see. What else I got here? Dog mom. <gasps> oh my gosh. One of you in 2020, I'm not even joking, made this design and sent it to me because I have this shirt from Target and I wear it all the time. This is before I had uh, K-Daisy, I think. And here's the shirt. This is so cute. I'm going down memory lane. I'm going down memory lane. I'm obsessed. Okay. Uh, looking glass. Oh my god, I'm Alice! Wait, what's on my back? The bear? Oh. Stop. I'm adorable. Speaking of magical girl. We got Alice. Do you do you love Alice in Wonderland? I read Alice in Wonderland in a single evening. I could not put it down. I must have been. Mm, 14, 15, and I read it for a book report, but I was, I could not put it down. It was, I was so intrigued and slightly disturbed. There's like math equations in it, drawings, all kinds of nonsense in there. It's crazy, but it's good. It's good. I love me some Alice Wonderland. Through the looking, through the looking class? A little scary. Not gonna lie. Okay. Un giorno di regno? Stop. Okay, so I have to explain this one. Un giorno di regno is an opera written by Giuseppe Verdi, and it is the first opera I did with the company I've been singing with for like 10 years. And this was our costume. We were like the maid, maids, maids and butlers, the chorus. It was a comedy. And I have to tell you, 
I will put a picture from all the pictures from this opera. I have to tell you, this was one of the most fun operas I ever did. And the preparation for this was like insane because I was living uh, in Boston, but I was working at a container store. But at the, but that week I was helping to open a container store in Providence, Rhode Island. So I would get up at like five in the morning, drive to Providence, work there all day and drive back to Boston and rehearse at night. It was wild, but it was the most fun I've ever had in my life. And this show was the best. I have nothing but good memories of Un Giorno de Reno. And this is, I guess, my homage to that opera. Ah, oh, good times. All right, next. Next. Study. I have one blank spot for... Oh my god, how cute. Wait, is that the, the sailor skirt that goes with the shirt I bought? I think it is. I think it was hiding in here. I don't like that your clothes g like get sequestered in whatever this like outfit, magical outfit <laughs> black hole is, but it's good to know. Interesting. That's also a very cute outfit. I have one blank spot. All right. Should we, uh, let's put one here. Let's put, oh wait, no, river outfit. All right. Let's just, let's just revert. Oh my gosh, how cute. How cute. How do we make a new one? Oh, do we have to go get changed, right? Is that the dealio? I think it is. Okay. First of all, I would like to change my hair. So, what color? Oh wait, I thought there was a mirror here. Is there a mirror here? There's just a phone booth. Well, that's a bummer. I thought there was a mirror. Bro, I need to change my hair. Plaza looking amazing. Um, who's, whose house can we go in that has a mirror? No one's house, really. All right, we're gonna have to go back home. It's fine. To change our hair, it's fine. Or, I'm realizing I'm stupid. I could have just taken a mirror out of my inventory and done it that way. But you know what? It's fine. We'll just go in the house and we'll change our hair in the bathroom. <laughs> like, like, we're, like in real life. I don't dye my hair, but I did tint it red at one point in my life and it looked terrible. So I just leave it the color it is. But in my Animal Crossing game, I can be, you know, all kinds of fancy. All right. Uh, brown? Is brown? Wait, let's see. Hmm. Brown is boring, right? Red? Red? Yellow? Blonde? Blonde? There's two blondes? There's like golden blonde and like kind of go blonde, blonde, straw, straw, blonde. There's the gray, which you know what is not bad. We might go with the dark gray because we had the, the white and there's the pink, purple, orange, red, blue, green. Is this like light blue? This also kind of eats blue. Nah, done. Love that. No. <laughs> oh, no! Really? Did he say it's a me? Not the Mario impressions, Raymond. Not not the Super Mario impressions. Okay, um, Raymond, what do you want? I'm I'm trying to be my best magical girl girl self. I'm here at last. Okay, here you go. Come on, come on in. Wait, are we are we twinning a little bit? We might be. Can I change inside? Oh no, I can just I can just touch stuff. I'm just touch. What? Can I borrow some of your stuff for a ten to twelve, twin to twenty week run of performance? No, you can't borrow any of my stuff, Raymond. What did I? Oh, that's why one of them got turned off. My little my little precious babies. All right. Oh, I can change in here. That's weird, huh? Should I do it right in front of him? I'm sorry, this is just so... That I... Pro <laughs> what? 
All right. He was like, you just take off, you just took off your clothes in front of me. But I didn't, I just, I transformed. Was that too much for him? I guess so. All right, well, oh my gosh, I keep doing that. I really wanna wear this, but we'll go with, with the magical girl outfit instead. We'll go with that. Can I, um, let's, let's get a new outfit going. I kind of like those outfits. <laughs> I mean, I would hope to, to like those outfits seeming as I created them, but I just don't use them. And I have completely forgot about it. Okay. Let's edit wand outfits. That's where you, that's what you do. Okay. We need to pick one last one. Does this one, I think this one should be like really just like all out crazy, right? Or should we, are we queen of, queen of fall? How do we dress as queen of fall? Because I want to wear this. Look how, doesn't it look like you could eat it? I'm so sorry. I, I know I, I, I always seem really hungry and I promise you I'm not. But I do think about food a ton and it looks like the most perfect like cookie or like cake. Not like a regular cake, like more like a Japanese cake, you know? With some glazed, melted something on it instead of frosting. Like it's whole, maybe it might even be like hard on the outside. Clear, like a crystalline kind of. <clears throat> yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's change. Um, am I the queen? How can I be the queen of fall? Is this queen of fall energy? It kind of is. Uh, not this. I love this China Poblana. I think it's great. But what do you wear with it? Wait, can we make an outfit with this? We're gonna have to put the, the bag back. The bag is, is too much. We're not, I guess, I guess we're, we're, we're leaving the queen of fall dreams to somewhere else. Dress up, see, I like dressing up. <laughs> I like dressing up. Okay, what can I do with China Poblana? All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up China Poblana and see if I can be like inspired by any outfits online. Chia Poblana. All right, images. <gasps> oh, it's like, it's like, uh, Flowers in the hair type dealio with like little cute <gasps> white tights, little cute shoes. <gasps> I don't know if we're gonna be able to do it, but it could be fun. Okay, here's here we go. Hair, hair is fine, but flowers in the hair, like something like this. Well, this is giving a little bit Snow White. It's gotta be like. Something like this, you know? But I, I'd rather... Why is there no big red flower, you know? Oh, wait, there is. There it is. Huh. Is that what we want to do? It's not big enough, though. I wish it were bigger. Like, ginormous. That would be so fun. Um... You can't really see the shoes which is an issue, but we can put them on anyway. <laughs> what do, what shoes go with this? Like these? Cute. You can't even see them. Uh, you can't see them. But I never wear them otherwise, so, you know. I mean, we don't have to keep this as a permanent outfit. Look at the wooden clocks. They're so adorable. Are those the ones that went, that went with my other outfits? I don't know. All right, I guess, <gasps> you know what else necessary? Boom. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, what do we, what do we, what do we call it? What do, what do we call, I mean, what do we call it? We just call it Chino Poblana. I think, I think that's safe. <laughs> oh no. China. China. Poblana. Po. Bla. 
Uh, nah. Dunsky. Actually really cute. Here's my question. Uh, should we edit this outfit? Oh no, not that one. This one. Are the red clogs better? Swap clothes. Oh yeah, these are like brown clogs. What about the, the, the other colors, the red? Is that better? I think it's cute. Do we need a bag? I mean, the natural inclination for me is to go with this one. Stop being so cute. Are we're so cute? Is that the bag? We should wait. Listen, I'm just playing dress up in a game. That's all I'm doing. That's really all I'm doing right now. No, we're, it's good. Change the name's fine. I love it. Um, you know what? Let's swap clothes for this one. And that is the sailor skirt I need. Uh, <laughs> no. All right. Well. Well, we can choose another one. Red, red's kind of fun. That's actually really cute. What about if it's just pants? It's cute if it's pants too. <gasps> oh my God, that's cute. Corduroy skirt, pink. Oh, the pink is really cute. I don't know what to do. The pink is kind of cute. What if it's this, this, yellow. Is yellow? If you were like a student in Japan, I heard like the longer skirt means you're kind of like a, a, like rebel girl. Is that true? You know, I don't know. That's just a word on the street. Tennis skirt? No. I, I'm into like all like the high school lore, you know, I think it's interesting. Cause high school for me is like way in the rear view mirror. And I love hearing about like the high school lore and like who's cool and uncool, what the rules are. I think we'll go with this. We obviously need a backpack. <laughs> Was this before uh, like bags? It might've been that I made this outfit, canvas backpack. No, I mean, I think we need that satchel, right? But then that takes that out of my inventory, which I guess is okay. I can always order another one. Look at the, like I have two of these. That's dumb. Okay, so I think that's done. No, this is fine. Cute. Cute. All right, um, I think we're done. We're done and we're still a magical girl. Oh, I'm in bed. <laughs> oh, whoops. <laughs> Should I be in bed? Let's get some sleep. Let's take a nap. We're gonna take a nap. We're gonna go, let's go to a random island and see what's up. I'm gonna do this tomorrow. I have a live stream tomorrow, scheduled tomorrow. So this is just practice, practice for tomorrow. You know? Okay, here we go. Uh, I want a dream. You know what, actually? I would like some inspiration for spring because we're decorating for spring. So ho let's hoping. Should we do a criteria search? Hmm. Let's get, let's go to any island that has spring in the name and we'll see if anything comes up. You know, we're just, we're, oh, pff, we're having fun. I'm not taking anything too seriously, okay? It's just a game. Spring. I need, you know what? Not a lot of people decorate for spring at Animal Crossing. And I, a bit, again, I'm the spring baby. I'm all about it. So I wanna see some nice springy islands. I wanna see cherry blossoms. I wanna see flowers. I wanna see it all. Okay, there's probably like a billion pages, 20 pages. There's an island called Spring. With all of these cute villagers on it. Look at that, it's so cute actually. 
Jessica plus three people. <gasps> Flora. That island doesn't have any, like, hardly any villages on it, though. Look at this one with a Frida. Spring and lavender. <gasps> I'm tempted to visit so many of these. Spring. They're all, they're all called spring. Dang it. All right, let's go to the one with like, which looks like the most spring-like villagers. Which I feel like is gonna be this one, actually. Oh, but it's got, it's got, it's got Rodney on it. Am I being trolled right now? Is this, I mean, March 23rd, 2024. I'm curious. Let's go to spring with Simon on it. I'm ready. That's a recent island too. Okay, I'm I'm hoping for the most inspiration. <laughs> but it is spring the lowercase, so maybe that took away some of my hopes. I don't know. I feel like a, a, attention to punctuation says something about the effort put into decorating the island, but I don't know. Maybe that's just me being prejudiced. It is raining, which is a vibe. Yeah. This might not be what I need, but we'll take a look anyway. It might not be like so much inspo, but it'll be, it'll be fun. I mean, the beginning, is this like, <laughs> what is this? This is like circus? <gasps> what is happening here? What? It's a circus? There's food! At least there's food and so many flowers. Like, just... So many. And... Sugar cane. And, and pumpkins. So much food. And, uh... She, she knows here. What did, what was that, what was that town tune? Did you listen? <laughs> Let's go in the house. Let's see. I don't know if this is what we're looking for, but we're, we're, we're having fun anyway. All that matters is if you had fun. That's all that matters, you know? <sighs> okay. It's, it's sparkly. A lot of things are sparkly. They, they were studying, you know? Okay, let's go back here. Oh, it's not a dungeon. It's like those uh, cyber walls. It reminds it's giving the last uh, dungeon in Twilight Princess. Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Who remembers that? Doesn't this wall remind you of that? Where you were in the Twilight Realm? Trying to save the twi the Twilight? Twi twi Twili? Twilight? Twili? Whatever. And... Wasn't there a master hand? Okay, nothing. Wasn't there a master hand in that uh, dungeon, which like took you back to the beginning? Wall hand, wall master, wall master. <laughs> Starting to think of what what the name of the enemy was. By the way, if you've never played, mm -hmm. if you've never played Legend of Zelda before, the wall master was this hand that would appear, and it was in. Early Zelda games, I think, if not all of them. If you were in a dun if you were in a dungeon, I mean, a dungeon is like many rooms, right? You could get lost. The wall master would come down from the ceiling or wherever, and it could grab you. And if it grabbed you, it took you. It takes you back to the beginning of the dungeon, and it's the worst. Plus, it hurts you. Look, there's Dom. There are so many, there's so many flowers. This island is just all flowers. Flowers for days. So many flowers. <laughs> it's an abundance of flora of all kinds and colors. 
Lots of flowers. At least we could sit here and reflect on our poor choice. <laughs> and we can stand beside an animal shoes. Yes. But you know what? The villager houses have like a door plates on them. Let's visit somebody. Let's see if any of the houses have been redone. I'm just curious. Oh my god, is this Dizzy's house? It doesn't look like it's been redesigned. I don't know what Dizzy's house looks like. He did get gifted a gyroid though. And that uh and a goldfish, which is actually adorable. And a nook ink t-shirt. They love Dizzy. And whatever this shirt is, like is that the young royal shirt? It's so cute. I need food. That's what I usually do. Um, also Dizzy is so cute. Like, I don't think I've ever, like, really hung out with him. But I just have to say, he's very cute. <laughs> he's really, really cute. <laughs> what say you? Does he keep saying, is, is I need food something that this, <laughs> this villager... The island owner has made him say... He doesn't say I need food, right? Because <laughs> that sounds not like a Nintendo-given catchphrase. Mm. <laughs> Look at all these flowers. What's in this house? I'm just too curious. Whose house is this? We'll never know until we go in. Because I can't get to the sign. Who, who lives here? <gasps> oh, it's Flora. Is this what Flora's house looks like? It's wild. Animal Crossing, really? Does she have this or was this gifted? Can I cook in a dream? No. Hi. Hey, welcome to my home. My room, I mean, it's just another, it's just a dream, but that doesn't make it any less, fa less fab. She was also looks like gifted a shopping cart. <laughs> and this mask. Which I'm disappointed she's not wearing. <gasps> Look at her little footprints. Look at her little footprints. That is precious. I'm making footprints as well. But that little touch in Animal Crossing is just so cute. And is this like wet? Yeah. This is the Oasis flooring. Really nice. I love... I love that, that she makes footprints in her house. That's so cute. <laughs> That's really cute. I've never had Flora. I love that there's a flamingo villager. That is just super cute. Okay. Oh, is this Mr. Simon? Spring is on its way. Yeah. You're cute though. Stop. You're actually really cute. You're cute. Look at how cute. Stop. You're adorable. <laughs> You're adorable. I can't. And wearing a LaBelle fashions. I can't with you. I cannot. All right, what else is around here? Look at the museum. Okay. Ooh, that's weird. Oh, this makes me think about <laughs> Breath of the Wild. <laughs> It's got shrine energy, doesn't it? I'm always thinking about Zelda. Do you guys have a video game franchise you're always thinking about? I love Zelda. If you, if you haven't been able to tell already. I cannot wait to finish Wind Waker and play Twilight Princess on the channel. Because Twilight Princess is my favorite Zelda game, pretty much. Because it's dark and gritty. And it's like... The realistic Zelda. And it's just the best. <gasps> Judy, my girl. How you doing? Hello, my dear. It's a pleasure to meet you in such a dreamy place. Hope you make some wonderful memories while you're here. Thank you. More importantly, I hope you're able to, to remember those memories when you wake up. Hire baby. <laughs> Hi, 
fire baby. Love that. This is nice, but I like the little like moss, the glowing moss action over here. It looks like there's been some volcano eruption, which is kind of fun. I like that. You know what? I like this rock deck. I like this rock decor, Simon. I'm into it. With also the gyroid things that have been washed up here. That, this, chef's kiss, I'm into it. All right, what's up here? What's up here? More flowers. So many flowers. So many flowers. So many flowers. Lots of flowers. But a perfect island. With, uh, with your uh, lily of the valley. This is also called Jacob's Ladder, which I don't... Why? Why is it called that? If you know in the comments, let me know. <laughs> why is it called that? Lilies of the Valley only bloom, like, during a brief time in spring, and they smell amazing. Uh, but at one point, I was looking to have Lilies of the Valley in my uh, bridal bouquet, and let me tell you, the price put me right off that idea. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. I was like, I looked at the price, and I was like, oh. <laughs> I'll just have seasonal flowers. And it is lilies of the valley, right? I I get a little bit in my uh, my grammar police hat when I hear and some you listen. I'm not the perfect English speaker. I'm I'm not. But when I hear things like mother-in-laws, what I guess it's maybe it's kind of a lost cause. And like I know what you mean. But aren't we meant to be saying mothers-in-law? Just like lilies of the valley instead of lily of the valleys. But I suppose are both kind of correct because I feel lilies of, lily of the valley is the name of the flower, right? And I guess I understand that you mean more than one by saying lily of the valleys. But I would prefer it <laughs> if I heard lilies of the valley. But I, you know what? Maybe it is correct to say Lily of the Valleys. But it just sounds wrong to me. It's like the when and whenever thing. That also makes me a little bit bonkers. When refers to a specific time. And whenever <laughs> refers to something that reoccurs. Is that right? So like... When oh, Tabby is serving looks. When I went to the store yesterday, I bought an apple. Whenever I go to the store, I usually buy apples, right? They don't mean the same thing. So you can't say whenever I went to the store yesterday. That doesn't make any sense. It's just my personal pet peeve. I'm following Tabby because she's adorable and I need to put eyes on her. Look at this outfit. She's matching perfectly. And I approve. Hello. Hey, BFF. Thanks for chatting with me. What's up? Sometimes when I can't make it in the morning, I run around in circles and scream really loud for a few minutes. That sounds like a horrible thing to do. But you do you. You look adorable. Stop it. All right, let's order some clothes and check. <laughs> Check the store for the turnip prices. And if they're higher than 115, we'll sell them. But if they're not, maybe we'll hold on. I don't know. What day of the week is it? Thursday? Mm. I don't remember. Okay. What were we going to order again? We were going to get, I have the Nook Shopping app, but we're going to do it here anyway, because Tom and Isabel. Okay. So we have to order a black bow is it called giant hair bow? giant ribbon giant ribbon okay black black place order by the way it's expensive wow should we get a red one too i don't think we have a red one in our inventory what if we do let's order wait nope let's order one anyway i feel like we don't have a red one i feel like it was given away okay next <laughs> next i feel as though i'm I'm missing some dresses. What 
at all these cute... You know what? I'm done. Let's visit the tailors just to see if they have anything fun. And then we'll go to the store. So many things to do, guys. There's just so many things to do. Oh my gosh, Sherb, hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, it must be Sherb's day to sweep the plaza. up. <laughs> Should we buy something new? We don't have, I haven't bought new clothes in forever. <gasps> we need to design outfits. There's so many things to do, friends. Okay. Let's go in, see what they got. See if we need to pick up anything up, pick anything up, you know. We're dressed like a magical girl, but it's okay. We have, we have two of these. I don't think I have this one or this one. Do I need it? I don't know. I think I have all of these. Gardening fail. Do I need this in real life? Is this something I should have? I just, I just got there without a hat on. I don't know. Uh. Oh wait, I'm kind of disappointed that like I don't need anything. I mean, fishing waders though. <laughs> the blue? No? What about the coveralls? These are for gardening. Do we need a whole gardening outfit? <sighs> Imagine you see me in my yard and I look like this. What do you say to me? Do you say, what are you wearing? Or you say like, what's up? You look great. Striped pants. Guys, I don't think I'm gonna buy anything. Oh, I have all of these. I love the kid's smock. I, I, I do. All right, forget it. Forget it, we're out of here. Thought you were gonna have something. It's fine. It's fine. Maybe tomorrow. Okay, last thing. Last thing, let's go check to see what the sitch is with the turnips, please. Cross your fingers <laughs> so that we can make some, oh! Anka's here, is, are you working here? What's going on? She's just staring at me like something was happening, okay. Uh, turnips, please, let me know. Ooh. What do we do? Should we just sell them and, and settle on our profit? Maybe we should. I'm tired of holding on to it. Maybe we'll sell, we'll sell most of them. Love this. This is my favorite new item in the game, pretty much. Love it. Anka, how you doing? Studio spotlight. But would I use this? My heart says I'll regret it if they sell out. Don't buy it. You don't need that. Come on. <laughs> what are you doing that? What are you using that for? She's gonna be the next booty guru. Can you be a booty guru anymore? Is that a thing? Like, is there a new, like if you are just entering the scene, can you now be a booty, or is that ship sailed? Is that passed? I'm, Tabby looks so cute, I'm so sorry. Look, I'm so, s Desi's online. Look how cute. Am I being creepy? Absolutely. 100%. So creepy. The creepiest. But I'm sorry. I, I, the cuteness is unmatched. All right, all right, let's go get them turnips. Go get them turnips. We'll make our, we'll make our money. <laughs> Cause I, okay, what day is it, of the week it is it? Fri Bro, it's Friday. <laughs> we need to get to step in. We probably missed the high price. We probably missed the spike. Oh no. I bet we missed the spike. Dang it. All right, well, that's fine. As long as we made a profit, I'm good. I'm good. I thought about redesigning one of my rooms in this series, but I don't know if I'm gonna get around to it. I don't know. All right. Uh-oh, I said series. And you know who, you know who said I, you know who thought I said their name. You know who it is. Ain't nobody talking to you, Siri. I'm sorry if I deactivated your, yours, your, uh, 
robot assistant. <laughs> Alexa, play the Animal Crossing soundtrack. <laughs> I'm sorry. I hope you have your headphones on. <laughs> Not me trolling during a Let's Play series. Okay. Let's go get rid of... Should we get rid of all of these or make some... Some... Wait a minute. Hold on. I might want to make some turn up DIYs. So let's check to see if anything is possible. What? Wait. I, it just, wait, we can make all of the Thanksgiving DIYs now? I mean, I don't know why this didn't register because I've already made two of them. <laughs> but I'm kind of shocked. Huh. I've never made the gratin. What kind of gratin do you think it is? Well, it says potato. It doesn't look like potato. It looks kind of weird. All right. Turnips. Turnips. Do you, do y'all see any turnip recipes? I don't see any. I have turnips in my pocket. How how would it be possible? To, oh wait, wait. Turnip salad. Okay. I might not have turnip recipes, to be honest. <laughs> you know, like I might just be fresh out of turnip recipes. That takes turnips. How come it says I can't make it? What? Will it only show craftable DIYs if they're not food? Hold on, hold, hold the phone. Hold. All right, wait a minute. All right, let's go in Anka's kitchen. I'm on here recording and being completely chaotic. Like. Oh my gosh, she got Starbucks. All right, let me, can I borrow your kitchen for just, what, just a sec? Yeah, all right, let's do it. What? <laughs> what? I don't? What do you mean? Is, this room is fabulous, because I designed it for you. You're welcome. Um. Do I need more than like just turnips to make turnip things? I guess I do. Okay, so obviously I can't make the turnip salad because I need a tomato. But like, I can't make anything else. Like I can make, what? I'm confused. Why can't I make this? <laughs> why, why, why can't I make this? Are you all yelling at your screen right now? I feel like my brain is broken. What are they? I feel like I should be able to make one of these recipes. Like the pickled, are there pickled turnips? Do pickled turnips exist? Is that a DIY? It should be. Um, tell me why, tell me why I, I this is not, 10 turnips. I don't understand. <laughs> All right. Well. Okay. The thing about this Let's Play series is that I'm alone. <laughs> and sometimes I do dumb stuff by myself. Stuff that I don't even understand. Like looking for these shopping baskets when they're right here, right? I, I don't understand why I can't make that DIY. And I had over a hundred turnips in my pocket. All right, let's just, let's just forget it. <laughs> let's just forget it. We'll sell all but, uh, but 20. Okay, what else is in here? Vertical banner, pergola, star fragments. I can keep all that stuff. All right, boys. Great. We did great. 
We didn't do very well at all. <laughs> we suck, actually. I... There was probably a spike. Dang it. Alright, well... I guess I'll figure it out. I love my farmer's market. I love it. I love it. Um, I am gonna cut the episode off right here. I will figure out the whole thing with the turnips. I promise. My villagers are out here being adorable and I am just gonna quit while I'm ahead. So thank you all for joining me on this episode of Animal Crossing and Chillin' and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.